showers and a few thunderstorms. Could be a soggy weekend, I think around an inch on average for most of us, especially further north. Uh, next week, more of that summertime look. Pop up shower storms and those temperatures right around 90 degrees. All right, thanks, Reed. There's a saying there's always an election going on in Louisiana, and it's almost true. Michelle Martin takes a look at why Louisiana's election system is often referred to as the jungle. We're about five months away from Louisiana's next major election. That's when voters will decide if Governor John Bell Edwards gets another four years at the helm of the state or if that honor will go to another contender. But before you head to the polls, I'm curious, what do you really know about Louisiana's election system? Do you know why we have a jungle primary, why it's referred to as a jungle primary? Not. What kind of election system do we have here? Well, we have, in Louisiana, we have a dual election system you can vote your conscious, your party favorite, your Republican or your Democrat or independent in Louisiana. Louisiana actually has a nonpartisan primary. All candidates, regardless of their party affiliation, are placed on the same ballot. That means your ballot could feature multiple candidates from multiple parties and you can vote for anyone. And that's something fairly unique to Louisiana. In a lot of other states, we have closed primaries where Democrats are on one ballot, Republicans are on another ballot, and there might not be any other affiliations. Or you, the individual, are registered Democrat and you have to receive a Democrat ballot, or you have to pick your affiliation on election day and then you get a ballot. None of those rules apply to Louisiana. All eligible voters may cast a vote in the election regardless of party affiliation. Because of this, our election system is often referred to as the jungle. You just throw in everybody in and everybody's competing and only one can emerge. It's everybody against everybody in an election. It may not surprise you if you remember your Louisiana civics class, but we have former Governor Edwin Edwards to thank for the shift to a jungle primary. Back in the 1970s, he convinced his fellow legislators that the shift from a closed primary would mean easier races and better outcomes. Get off your phone, please. He envisioned this as a way for Democrats and Republicans to be on the same playing field and hopefully Republicans would receive the same treatment as Democrats during the primary. Another quirk about Louisiana elections is there's no guarantee there will be a general election. You can in fact end all of your elections in the primary process and you never move on to a general election. If one candidate receives 50% of the vote or more in an election, they are the outright winner. If no candidates receive 50% or more, the top two vote getters, regardless of party, then move on to the general election. All right, thanks, Michelle. Now through June 13th, make sure you enter your yard in the Twin City Outdoor Yard of the Week contest. Weekly winners are announced every Friday, and one of them will get the grand prize, which includes a Gravely ZTR mower, a new one, a steel Kobe system, and a Hobie fishing kayak, all worth about 6000 bucks. Enter by going to myarchlevis.com and clicking on that contest tab. Hey, so many events taking place in Northeast Louisiana, but our friend Sheila Snow is here to break down. We'll chat with her next on Fox 14.